and gentlemen, I'm Easy69. Welcome back to uh, the channel. Now, previously, a while ago, uh, we done a video where we explain why people still play the game. Uh, there was a couple of things on there uh, where we obviously people have been playing for a long time, like nine years, and uh, that's a long time for a mobile game. And we talked about why people are still playing the game and of course you've got things like they spent a lot of money uh they've you know they've made friends and you know it's things like that and a lot of the reason that is why people are still playing the game if you didn't make friends and if you didn't spend a lot of money then would you still be playing the game after so long Probably not. Um, today we're going to talk about why people are not playing the game. Like why people have quit the game. Why people just don't want to play Blitz any longer. So there are a few things. There are a few things that have been like bubbling up in people and they've been wanting to quit uh, but they just can't bring themselves to it uh, so we're going to talk about just some of them we're going to talk about some of the reasons why people uh, are quitting the game so first up we have obviously if you go into the store we've got things like crates now crates have been around for a very long time they're going to continue to be in the game we've just got to face it you know they're going to be there and we've just got to face it that they are not going anywhere they bring wargaming money uh, a lot of money so there's no reason why they should um, be removed in the game. Now, I'm not a lover of them, obviously. Uh, yeah, okay, I'll buy some of them occasionally um, if I think they're worth it. And I always recommend you guys not to waste your money on the game. But not just that. I mean, there isn't one... Uh, there is one, sorry. There is one right now. But recently, if crates wasn't enough, you know, if crates wasn't gambling enough, they then introduced the lucky draw. Now, We've already had enough of crates. We've already had, had enough of gambling. And they end up bringing something new to the gambling. And that is the lucky draw. Where obviously you can buy them. Uh, you can spend gold and you're able to get the middle tank or it might not even be a tank now some people get lucky and get it but yeah i'm very early on i mean for 30 gold or 50 gold then yeah it's not bad but it's the fact that it is gambling you know it's the fact that it's still gambling whether or not you get lucky or not it is still gambling and again that is why a lot of people have uh, have left the game because they've had enough of the gambling um so that's another reason why people have quit blitz and uh, another reason now we are going to look at is a tank like this now we are going to look in detail at the amx 50b because of course it has been uh, buffed it's it's a very good tank now um it, well it was already a very good tank but it's been made even better um but it's not just the tank itself it's the type of tank now the auto loader tank um these are i've said it before i've said it literally like a, a couple of years ago these have like overrun these are now overrunning in blitz you know auto loading tanks there's they're everywhere they are literally everywhere um i mean this game is not too bad there's not that many i mean you've got the kranwagen you've got the tvp on the enemy team uh this and this team you've only got the amx 50b so in fact this team uh, or this battle doesn't quite show um how the the battles are at the moment because you can get five or six auto loaders because wargaming don't uh do their um, they don't do their matchmaking when it comes to sort of auto loaders or non auto loaders uh they do it in tank types so heavies mediums tank destroyers lights and the fact that you've got a, a light tank in tier 10 a bat chat that is an auto loader you could have that with a tvp uh, the tvp is an auto loader you could also have that with an fv4005 um which is an auto loader on top of that you can also then have a couple of uh heavy tanks the kranwagen or the amx 50b uh, so you could actually if you work it out you could actually have seven auto loaders on a team i think i've done it once i haven't really paid attention since then if i'm honest um but yeah you can it, it, the auto loading game uh, it, is sort of it has overrun in blitz it's all about auto loaders and some of them are very very strong uh, very strong tanks um but yeah some people like it some people don't like it uh i don't mind it at the moment of course uh, but 
it depends on what you, what happens. You know, if you're going to get like this game, it's not that bad because there's only one or two on the team. But yeah, if you join a game and there is five or six, it does ruin. Uh, it can ruin your game because it's just auto loaders everywhere. Um, and then pretty much the final thing at the top of my head is the, the state of the game at the moment. Now, Wargaming, I don't mind too much. I mean, it hasn't bothered me that much. And the, the players, you know, how bad some of the players are, especially when it comes to Tier 10 players, they are really, really bad. And if you're one of those that just love playing Tier 10, and <laughs> it is sort of, again, overrun by just bad players very bad player like this grill here i mean he might be a good player but he's just sitting there in the open it's a four versus four he's a one shot i don't know why he's just sitting there and not sort of at least trying to hide um but overall the players nowadays in blitz are not the greatest of players they really are really really are not great players um on top of that things like especially the eu server where they they take off chat so you can't even chat in the game now and that's because of one reason because of how toxic it is uh, if you go look at my world of dummies uh, videos how much there are of uh, people absolutely raging people being racist um so there's a few reasons there are a few reasons uh why people have stopped playing the game now if you add all those together then there are a lot of reasons to stop playing Blitz if you add all those together. But there's one thing I haven't mentioned. There's one thing I haven't mentioned, which is number one, which is the top, top reason why people have stopped playing Blitz. And obviously there is a reason why people get bored. You know, it's a game after all, after some time, uh, people will get bored of, of a game. And I get that, everyone understands that. But for me, the biggest reason, or yeah, the biggest reason why people have stopped playing Blitz is, is actually, when you look at it, is very, very simple. And that's just because of age. That's because of age. Not because people were so much getting bored of it, but when I started the game, it was sort of eight years ago, then there was players that I was in a clan with, very, very good uh, a clan, and very, very good players. All these guys were like 14, 15 years old, and they were incredible, absolutely incredible. Um, those of you that maybe uh, remember Zenodium, I used to share a clan with him uh, in Phoenix, and then he come to GNA. At the time when he was doing tournaments and pretty much being the best player in the game, he was literally like 13 years old. Now, nine years on, this guy's like 20, 21, 22, like 22, 20, yeah, 22, 21, like he's got a life and that's the, that's the thing, like he's got a life now, you know, back when you're 13, you're at school, uh, maybe you don't go out with your friends, you sit at home, you play blitz in your bedroom, um, but you know, it's a bit different when you're 22 years old, this, this guy who I used to play the game with when he's 13 might even have children of his own right now you know they might he might be sort of five six years old for all i know uh his kids so it's just growing up you know people have grown up of course yes there are adults that play the game like myself that are, you know there's not much that's changed from me uh since i started the game to now um but there are a lot of players that you know the the younger age uh the, the player base uh that are the 13 the 14 year olds that are at school They've now probably got a family. They've now probably got a wife or a husband. They might have kids. And most importantly, they've probably got a job. And that all will get in the way. That will get in the way of playing a mobile game. So that, for me, is the top reason why people have quit Blitz. Not because of the rage. Not because of the teams. Just because, I mean, that yes, that is a reason. But 
the ultimate reason is people have just outgrown Blitz, you know, they've grown up, they've got older, and they've got a life. <laughs> that is literally ultimately what it comes down to. They've got a life, they've got a family, they've got a job, they're not at school anymore like it used to be. Uh, but that for me is the top reason. If I've missed any out, let me know in the comments below. But for now, if you've been around for nine years since the beginning, almost like myself, and plenty of other adults out there, because those of you that have been around since the beginning, you are now adults. You have to be. There's no like you, you, you have to be an adult, otherwise you you probably started when you was like four or five. Um, so let me know, hit me up in the chat, it, hit me up in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, uh, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Uh, it does help me out a lot. And don't forget, this weekend coming, uh, we do have a giveaway. So if you want to be in a chance to win a T95 E6, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. But for now, hope you enjoyed it. I'm Meadzy, and I will catch you all soon. Bye-bye.